So I'll give you a, just a brief overview of how I recommend studying for the LSAT. I recommend a five step approach. I call it the laser focus approach to LSAT prep. It's laser because it stands for learning, accuracy, sections, exams, and review. Learning is doing your work untimed, doing questions by type, reviewing textbooks, learning theory. The phase one of, learn is of LSAT prep with the laser focus approach is learning theory. Stage two is accuracy, doing questions untimed by type perhaps, individual questions, individual logical reasoning questions, individual games, individual passages. Stage two, stage three is sections, S for sections, doing full individual five, uh, 35 minute timed sections, meaning four games or four passages or 25 or so logical reasoning questions. That is the next stage and that helps you work on your pacing. Stage four is endurance or exams, doing full length five section timed exams to properly simulate test day conditions. Then step five is the review process. The review process involves analyzing where your mistakes came from if they were in the stimulus for logical reasoning, interpreting the question stem, or in the answer choices. If it was in the stimulus, you want to evaluate, did you understand the method of reasoning fully and thoroughly? If it was in the question stem, you want to make sure that you're thoroughly taking the time to understand what question type you're dealing with, what they're asking you for. And if it is in the answer choices, you want to see, was your mistake in being tempted by a particular wrong answer that seemed appealing, or were you discouraged from picking an unappealing, correct answer? So there are these traps of encouragement towards the wrong answers and traps of discouragement away from the correct answers. You want to just check to see where your mistakes lay because of course you're not falling for every single mistake or else you'd like be, likely be getting a 120. And so if there are particular mistakes that you are uniquely prone to making, you've got to figure out what those are so that you can avoid making those same mistakes in the future. Thanks for tuning into the show. Please subscribe if you haven't done so already to be notified of new episodes as I release them. And feel free to reach out if you need anything at all as you move forward with your prep. I'm happy to help however I can. In the meantime, I wish you all the best and take care.